Hello, matey peeps. Got the uh, alarm roll going outside. Not without me on it, of course, or anything like that. But that's the noise. Hopefully, you can hear me. Alright, exercise of the day today. So, what we're going to do is a box plank. Alright, then we've worked our wrists. We've done all kinds of other things. We've controlled pelvis, so we want to be able to put this together now to make sure we're able to engage this, keep it stable, but also obviously, of course, this, so it's not just the tummy, the tummy works with the hips, works with the shoulder, etc. So, let's do this, let's get our, spread these hands, really grip down hard, okay, position those shoulders directly over those hands or wrists, and then bring your knees under your hips, remember to dig those toes in, guys, so really dig your toes and bring the knees and toes as close to each other as you can. All right, once we're there, we can just make that readjustment. We want to give ourselves a nice long back of the neck. Remember, that's a short back of the neck. All right, we want to be here. Just tuck, just lengthen, just gently tuck that chin. All right, we're going to ever so slightly as well tuck the tail on, okay? Ever so slightly, but maybe first, while we're working this top end, just lengthen out, so tail on through crown of head, just lengthen the back of the neck, tuck the chin slightly, push, with those strong hands, corkscrewing the elbow pits forward and pushing to spread those shoulder blades. Make sure the shoulders don't come near the ears, pack away, okay? And then we can lightly tuck that tailbone, pulling those bottom ribs down. Think about squeezing the butt cheeks, be in that tucked position. Keep those shoulders spread, keep the long back of the neck, keep the shoulders away from the ears, take all the slack out of your body. Just take the knees off the ground just that little bit. Now what's going to make this a little bit more challenging is keeping that pelvis in that position. Don't let it come to here. Slight tuck. Shoulders spread. And just slightly get that forward shoulder lock. Keeping those knees close to the ground. And you can hear in my voice. And you can see that I'm shaking now. Oh, that's a lot more challenging. So keep squeezing the butt. Keep that pelvis tucked. Shoulders spread. Knees just hovering off the mat. Long back of the neck. When you're ready, come back. And place down, okay? So that's just a lot shorter plank, obviously, than having those legs out. You're going to get some additional wrist work, you're going to get some additional shoulder work, and you're going to be engaging that tummy. Really feeling that the muscles are doing what they're supposed to be doing, rather than what a lot of times people do is just come into all, you know, internally rotating, cranking on the neck, hanging on the joints of the spine, doing nothing the areas that we want to be working. So again, just recap. Get those toes digging into the mat with the hips, uh, with the feet and knees hip width. Get those knees as close to your toes. Position your shoulders over your hands. Corkscrew. Elbow pits are forward. Pat the shoulders. Lengthen out tailbone crown of head. Lightly tuck that chin. Lengthen that back of the neck. Push down, spreading those shoulder blades. Tuck that tailbone, take the slack out of your body, and then just ease those knees off the mat. If you've got that, if you can hold that position, just get that forward shoulder on as far as you can, maintaining that tuck, maintaining those protracted shoulders. Then just hold. When you're ready, come back, touch down. Alrighty, nice drill, and it's going to lead us into other exercises too. And remember, you don't need that much space. You could, in your living room tonight, while you're watching a bit of TV, you could do maybe a bit of hip work, you could do maybe a bridge or something like that, so just wrap up this area. You could maybe do uh, some of your wrist bending before you get in this position, and then go for it. All within maybe two minutes, you've done a little bit of floor play, you've done your body good. Do you want to get better? Thought so. Keep doing that. Okay.